Hi guys, welcome back to the JNET testing framework tutorial. In this session, I'm going to explain test suite in JNET framework. So, so far we have seen whenever we are want to execute the particular test case, we are going to that particular class and right click run as JNET test. That is how we have executed. Now, there might be a, some scenario where you want to group a um, few set of the test cases which are comma which are, which might be a specific to a, a particular component or the module you want to execute all those uh, test classes in one shot in that case the test suite is going to help you to achieve this particular functionality so i am going to demonstrate how you can execute um, multiple test classes one shot one shot using the um, test suite so let us give the class name as test suit demo and the first thing is what we need to do is at the class level you need to annotate it with run with and then this is going to take a class suit dot class now let us import this suit from org dot jnet dot runners dot suit and then you can annotate it with suit classes and this is going to accept the values as a property and which has nothing but the array of the test classes in in our scenario we have the ap test dot class and asset methods demo dot class and handling exception test case dot class and test basic automatic operations demo dot class class and yeah so these are the classes in our uh, particular um, uh, test uh, package we have now what we are going to do is we are going to run all these um, test classes at one shot so that you can see the output it will execute the all the test cases which are available in each um, test class okay now right click run as j unit test now if you see here it has executed 10 test cases and if you see here first one is the test suit demo in this first we have the app test in this basically one test case it has executed and one actually it got ignored and similarly we have asset uh, methods demo we have one um, assets method validation we have the one method which is failed by default and then in the exception uh, handling exception test class we have two test cases those two are executed and it is succeeded and then we have a uh, test basic operate uh, automatics operations demo we have total five uh, test cases out of them one got failed due to automatic exception so in order to execute group of test classes as a single unit we are going to use the concept of test suit which will logically group similar functionality or the similar uh, functionality related test cases and execute at one shot so hope you clear with the concept of test suit and thanks for watching have a nice day